Agora TV. The world is thinking. Perhaps one of the most interesting group of nudibranchs are the, the Aeolidina, and these all have these appendages coming off the backs, um, and almost all of the Aeolids, as they're commonly called, feed on um, sea anemones and their relatives, different kinds of salenterates. And they take the stinging cells, the nematocysts, um, from their prey and can transport them through the digestive tract and deposit them in the tips of these finger-like projections called serrata. And they can utilize those nematocysts then for their own defense. It's really an amazing um, evolutionary adaptation that um, they take the defensive mechanisms of a prey item and then can utilize that for their own defense. This particular species here, um, which is generally floating around in the open ocean, feeds on the Portuguese man of war. And if you find one of these on the beach, on a tropical beach, um, and you pick it up, you'll get the same sting that you would from picking up a Portuguese man of war. I don't advise it. 